hello guys um, welcome to another video um, got some pretty I'm pretty ex happy today and excited because finally I got to lay hands on my side by side is it one of these beautiful uh, machines from Polaris no I got one of these the Roxor. So I just got a 2018 uh, Mahindra Roxor. And uh, if you've been watching any of my recent videos, you have a little bit of the history on this. Uh, now you might be wondering which one did he get? Did he get the black one, the carbon black or the white? Well, there she is. So I got the fire orange. And this one is actually an LE. Um, no, sorry, a classic two. So there are four trim levels. Uh, if you uh, remember, uh, there's uh, the classic. There's the classic two. Uh, there is the limited edition, and then there's the special edition. So this is the one I just got. Got it today, and I'm about to load it up and take it home. Um, I'm pretty pretty excited. Uh, I had the engine started a little bit earlier, about an hour earlier. It's about 40 degrees right now. Hopefully it gets to start because uh, they don't actually have glow plugs. What they have is uh, the air going into the engine is heated. So it's not really, really, really a glow plug that they have in there. Um, I was so excited to have this one. So I didn't even come for a test drive or anything. It's pretty tall. So let's jump in and see what we have. Ugh. All right, there you have the dash. Put in the key, turn it on. I have 55.5 miles, four hours on this machine. Well, it's brand new, so <laughs> that's the best I could get. I love the color. I wasn't gonna wait for anything specific or lower hours or lower mileage. Um, it's 40 degrees, I didn't see if if it cycled through but the glow light is not on so i'll go ahead and fire it up starts right up and what's really amazing is how quiet this thing is i don't know about you guys but mine smokes a little bit when it first starts up i hope that's nothing serious maybe it's because it's been sitting or i don't know but yeah i was told it smokes a little bit we'll see when we break the engine in uh, sounds really quiet uh, I can hear the turbo haven't had time to play with it I don't know how you cycle through the gauge uh, right now it's just showing the Mahindra and the RPM of the engine running really smooth super smooth all the smoke is gone you can barely feel the vibration it's barely there so nice steering wheel well let's go ahead put it in gear and get it on there the gear shifts really easy but I think it, when you go to a uh, reverse it hits the the parking brake the e-brake make sure we are in two two wheel drive yeah too high I think we are from the angle of uh, the shifter all right so we are in first gear take that off and uh, power steering feels awesome whoa <laughs> yeah it's super silent you can't even tell it's a diesel it's just it's just amazing really amazing there I'm in first gear I didn't even have to step on the gas it just started moving on its own slowly good shocks silent um, if you just acquire one of these, I know there's been a couple of complaints about... Let's see how tight it can turn. It's turning pretty tight. Uh, about the front uh, leaf springs making a noise. So I think that's one of, one of my first uh, projects. But of course, the very, very first one would be to send out the uh, ECU to one of the gurus, either uh, Diesel Freak or uh, VR Racing out in 
Arizona to have a, have a tune. But I'm leaning a little bit towards a, uh, towards a Diesel Freaks uh, Stage 2 tune. So I'll see how that works out. I haven't decided yet. You see, I don't even have to touch the gas and I'm backing up. It's just so much power. You can kind of tell the engine is subdued. It's restrained. Uh, you barely hear any sound. So I know there's been a lot of uh, there's a lot of restriction going on so we're trying to get on there I'll go part of the way stop and then I go verify and make sure I'm good like right there I'll stop then jump out make sure I'm not falling <sighs> yep I guess I'm well centered so I should be able to come up straight Let's go around. Yeah, it sits really, really tall. All right, let's get it on. Ah. Get the packing brake off. Slowly roll it forward. <laughs> I love that engine. And we're on. There. Parking brake on, turn it off. Okay. So we got it on the trailer. Exciting times. Got the parking brake, and I think it's still, we put it in first gear, which is quite heavy. There, it's in first gear. Right, close the net door. Right here, close that up. Boom. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty excited, even though it's cold, but <laughs> it's good having the rocks there. All right, I believe I need my two hands, but yeah, guys. So we'll be having more videos in the coming days and weeks since I finally got my hands on uh, on my on my rocks. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you haven't yet, go ahead and subscribe, and uh, you have many more rocks or videos coming your way. Thanks for watching again.